What is up everybody? It's no one Chuck coming right back at you with another Star Trek Fleet Command video. Today, we are going to talk about what the true cost of the Gladius is to upgrade. And we're going to go from there. These, this is going to be a three-part series on um, the Gladius, the Intrepid, and the Brel. It's going to be split up three times this week. You guys will see them as they come out. And we'll go through it and we'll see what the true cost of the ships are. Because... When I was running my numbers, it was quite a, a shocker, just on the price of it. So here's Gladius, this pretty ship. We're going to look at that and the true cost of it. We're going to do a comparison on the packs, or the current pack we have, since we don't have the Interceptor pack. We can't really take that into account for this video because it would make it way less, but it's still a pricey one if you just want to go pure spending versus the route of slowly level it the pack we're going to use example from is going to be the ultra ship power pack and i have all the numbers put into my uh excel document i'm going to show you guys right now so let's look at the excel document so let me open that up for you guys Do -do 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 -do. and boom so let's open the excel document so all these numbers that you see right here i've listed trit dill crystal gas uncommon crystal uncommon gas rare crystal rare gas and interceptor parts i'm um, all listed out i got this one right here right from l cars itself and we'll look at the total cost per tier versus the total cost in general so i'm not going to do like my old ones where you're like this what this this how many packs cost to do this nah i'm not doing that right now so it's going to cost 3.7 million trit, 90k in Dell, 4,100 common crystal, 625 common gas for tier one. For tier two, it's 20 million trit, 173 million Dell, 3,900 crystal, 1,000 gas, 802 interceptor parts, and so on and so on, as we can see here. The total cost of the Gladius is 3.3 billion in trip, 56 million in the lithium about 45k in common crystal 8400 in common gas 22 or 20,675 in uncommon crystal 6364 in uncommon gas 3716 in crystal rare crystal 899 in rare gas about 141,000 interceptor parts and here's the pack breakdown of it so we have the pack is your 190 mil trit 1.7 mil in the lithium, 2200, not really 2200, 2200 in Chris, common crystal, 1310 in common gas, 392 in uncommon crystal, 264, 260 in uncommon gas, 48 rare crystal, four, or 32 gas, and 220 interceptor parts. So for the common gas, the common crystal, common gas, and latinum, or Latinum interceptor parts, we're already considered that Latinum. That's a Latinum wash. Because if you look at, oh, remember these packs are Ops 39. So it's going to go per each one. So if you want to look at Latinum wise, we're looking at what? The pack gives you 30K and you want to X that by 72. Let me put my calculator out. I probably could do this math easier somewhere. So 30,000. X by 72 equals about, wow, that's a lot, 2.1 mil in thing, and, or in Latinum. So we'll wash that out. So in trade, it costs you 18X on the pack, 32X in dill, 52X of the pack in uncommon crystal, 24X in uncommon gas, 77X in crystal, 28X in gas so the average is about seventy seven hundred dollars because the packs are about ninety nine dollars um if you're looking at the saving aspect when you look at the pure titanium and pure dilithium at mine it's about 80 percent savings so that's about a 2.5 billion in savings for trit and a 44 million in dilithium so the totals changed from the 3.3 billion down to 900 million and the total in dilithium goes from 56 million down to 11.2 million. I didn't take into account some of the, um, let me go back to the game. Let's pop that back up. 
let's go back to the game. Uh, where's that? Where's that? Where's that? Where's it at? There's a game I didn't take into account. Let's go to research. Because I'm not 100% sure if it really affects the commons or any of that. So I didn't really include it into this. But let's see. So we have, it's not the combat, it's in the station. So click on stru or ship structure it should save you crystal. I don't think that really takes an effect. And then we have, I'm not sure what that takes. And we still have the pure part. So you have the interceptor one. So that's why I said it was lat. And then the other ones is pure crystal, pure. See, we're not sure because it never gives us exact on it because it improves the cost effect efficiency of crystal for components. It doesn't really tell you if it's the rare, the common, or the uncommons. So from looking at packs, the ship's going to cost you seven, 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 or 7,700 USD to get the pack or get the ship fully upgraded to tier nine. Yikes. That's a lot of money for that one. But you can get the crystal if you do the swarm events, which helps you out. You can get a lot of that through doing events if you take the long route. As long as you're not willing to, to fork over the money right away, then you're all fine. Remember, guys, it is no one shall signing out. Remember to like, hit the uh, subscribe button, hit the bell notification, hit that join button down below if you want to help me support me monthly. And that's about it. Remember, this is a three-part series. I still have two more coming after this. All right, guys, have a great day. Peace out.